Hi, everyone. My name is Carol Smith, and I am here today to talk to you about the Google Summer of Code program that I manage. For those of you who don't know, Google Summer of Code is an online international program that is designed to get university students engaged and participating in open source software development. We think Google Summer of Code is a pretty cool program because the students get real-world coding experience. They get references from within the open source organizations that they work with. The open source organizations get more developers and more development time. And more open source code is created for the benefit of everyone. This year marked the 10th instance of the Google Summer of Code program. And so I wanted to take a couple of minutes to say a really profound thank you to our community. Some of you are sitting in the audience today. And we could not have made the last 10 years as successful as they have been without your support and participation. So thank you. Please give yourself a round of applause. In honor of the 10th instance of the program, we did 10 things to change and promote the program. And I wanted to give you a few of the highlights from this year. One of the things that we did is we raised the student stipend from $5,000 to $5,500 for a student who successfully completes the whole program. We accepted more students than we ever have before, 1,307 in all. And those 1,307 students were selected from amongst 4,420 applicants from all over the world. In all, over the last 10 years, we have had 8,616 students participate in Google Summer of Code, which is an amazing number. Yes, thank you. <laughs> we also accepted more mentoring organizations than we ever have before this year, 190 in all. And those 190 organizations were selected from amongst 372 applicants, again, from all over the world. In all, over the last 10 years, we have had 486 organizations participate in Google Summer of Code. Again, an amazing number. <laughs> Lastly, we're going to be holding a reunion in October for our students, mentors, and organization administrators who have participated in the program over the last 10 years. We're inviting everyone to visit us in California and spend three days with us. That's longer than the Mentor Summit that we typically hold for this program, and we expect it to be almost double the size. We estimate that over the last 10 years, our students have created over 50 million lines of code. Again, a really amazing number. <laughs> Those students have primarily, or have largely been from the United States, India, and Germany. But over the last 10 years, we've noticed a shift away from applicants in the US and Northern Europe, and we've seen more and more students from India, Southeast Asia, and other developing nations. For the last three years in a row, we've had more students participate from India than we have from the United States. We also see new countries represented in the Summer of Code program every year. The last two years, we've had students from Cameroon, Tunisia, Honduras, Kenya, Malawi, and Uganda. And of course, we're always trying to do more outreach to the underrepresented areas and developing nations of the world, and we can always use your help in getting the word out to more and more of those students. It's a common misconception that students who participate in Google Summer of Code are all majoring in computer science. We see students majoring in dance, film, philosophy, linguistics, fil uh, philosophy, and many other majors as well. It's also a common misconception that students who participate in Google Summer of Code are all undergraduates. While 68% are, we also have 22% who are getting their graduate degrees and 10% who are PhDs. We've also had some really amazing success stories come out of the students every year and from Google Summer of Code, and I wanted to talk about just a couple of those. We had a GSOC student who was at CERN when the Higgs boson was discovered. We had a GSOC student who competed in the London Summer Olympics in race walking. We had a GSOC student who received an Academy Award that began as his GSOC project. <laughs> And most importantly, I think, is that we have students every year who begin as novice coders and go on to become core contributors for their organizations, which I think is really the best success story of all. So again, I want to say a really, really profound thank you to our community. 
we really could not have done it without your success, your participation and support of the program. And so we hope that you'll help make us in the next 10 years even more successful than these last 10 years have been. The uh, website, if you're interested in learning more about the program, is google-melange.com, and that's a, a little URL for you to check out our discussion list if you have any questions you'd like to ask about the program. And finally, I just wanted to leave you with a picture from our Mentor Summit from a couple years ago to show you that we have a really thriving and vibrant community, and this is a really great program. So again, thank you.